The Andres Bonifacio Monument, commonly known simply as Bonifacio Monument or Monumento, is a memorial monument in Caloocan, Philippines which was designed by the national artist Guillermo Tolentino to commemorate Philippine revolutionary Andres Bonifacio, the founder and supremo of the Katipunan. Andres Bonifacio fought for independence from the politically and socially ruthless colonial rule by Spain. The monument 45 feet 14 meters in height with symbolic images and other features known as the Cry of Balintawak is acclaimed as one of the best monuments in the world. Location the monument is located in South Caloocan at a roundabout crossing of four roads, namely Epifanio de los Santos Avenue, EDSA, MacArthur Highway, Samson Road and Avenida Rizal, the old road leading to Manila. History The Bonifacio Monument recalls the Philippine Revolution which was spearheaded by Andres Bonifacio who had urged his men to raise against the colonial rule of Spain. His call to take arms against the Spanish rule was given on 23 August 1896, which is widely known as Cry of Pugad Lawn. The Conriner Stone was formally laid by Aurora Quezon, the wife of Filipino Senate President and later President Manuel L. Quezon. The monument, which was created under the orders of American Governor General Frank Murphy, was inaugurated on 23 October 1933. It was inaugurated by the Speaker of the House, with much fanfare in a colorful function led by three women from Luzon of the Women's College, Visayas of the Institute of Women, and Mindanao of the Centro Escolar de Senoritas, Center for Women, with other women representing the eight provinces of Manila, Cavite, Batangas, Bulacan, Pampanga, Tarlac, Nueva Ecija, and Laguna which had participated in the Revolution of 1896. On 30 November 2013, the sesquicentennial of Bonifacio's birth and the 80 80th anniversary of the monument's unveiling was celebrated. Features The Bonifacio Monument, which was sculpted by Guillermo Tolentino in 1933, an obelisk, rises to a height of 45 feet 14 meters. The obelisk is made up of five parts representing five aspects of the society. Katastasan, Kagalangaling na Katipunan ng Mga Anak ng Bayan, highest and most venerable association of the sons of the nation. It is crowned by a figure with wings representing triumph. Below the vertical pylon, 20 figures cast in bronze have been molded over an octagonal shaped plinth, plus one angel of peace at the top. The octagon represents the eight provinces who fought against Spain and also represents eight rays of the Katipunan flag. The plinth is raised in three steps, each step representing the three centuries of Spanish rule. These figures are a representation of the people of Philippines, who faced inequality, agony and suppression under the colonial rule which eventually ended in an armed revolution in 1896. The main central image of the monument holds a bolo, a machete, in the right hand and a gun in the other hand. At the back of the central figure a flag of Katipunan in an unfurled state is depicted. A remarkable feature of the molded images of the human figures is the classic style with detailing marked by realistic expressions reflecting the revolutionary spirit with an upright head and body, and with arms spread on the sides. The central obelisk is surrounded by pools of water. References http://caloocancity.gov. <references> 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 ph. About Us, History of Bronze Monument. <references>